Hi, I'm Brad from the Rowland Academy in Shrewsbury College, and this is my demonstration of the Rowland VG99. the setup we've got the squire strap with the uh, GK3 pickup screwed in there that's going out to the VG99 which I've then sent through the main out through this cable into the Sonar V Studio the VS100 which is going into my laptop which is running QBay and then also we have this MIDI interface, MIDI to USB, which is also going to be laptop, which is what I use to do the snare and the hi-hat sounds. So the way I did the drums, I got a bass patch on the VG99, which uh, takes all the notes an octave below on the guitar, which is better for um, the drums on cue bass, because the uh, drums, well you can't get a bass drum with a guitar patch. For some reason, sure, if you fiddled around the cue bass enough, you could figure out how to do it. But this is the way I'm doing it. I've got a bass patch in the VG99. Um, so, yeah, there you go. There's drums and bass, but we don't want drums and bass. We just want drums. So we turn the bass down on the pickup, and then there, there's your drums. I don't know if we can turn this around to try and play you something. Yeah. What have we got around here? See so if we can prop you up. So, uh. So, uh, kind of goes like this. No, it doesn't. That's just plucking the strings. But I'm not a drummer, so I'm not too good at that kind of stuff. So an advantage of having this besides on the normal guitar is uh, this pickup is uh, is actually six different pickups all in one, and it picks up one string each 
right, which takes it to this, which means you can have a bass on the low E, and then all the guitar strings on the top str on the uh, thinner strings, which means what you can do, you can play uh, guitar and bass at the same time, which is uh, is pretty cool. I'll show you in there. So we got here's a bass, bass on its own. Might be pretty loud on top of that speaker. Uh, here's a guitar. Here's like a Les Paul song kind of sound. And then here's them together. There's bass and guitar. And of course you could have uh, as many bass strings as you wanted on this, you could have the E and the A, so then you can go up to the 4th, you know, in the 145, and then the 5th, that sort of thing. Cool. That's what I like about it anyway. So. GK3 pickup, which is what you need to uh, get the sound out of the guitar and into this. That's roughly 119 pounds, and this, the VG99, is 999 pounds, and you can get them from the internet or music shops such as Anderson's. Um, and the benefits from using this preferred to like a instead of a normal guitar is that um, alternative tuning just press a button on here here you go we can change the Tuning. So yeah, it's an octave below bass, that's stupidly low. We can go an octave above the bass, which is basically a guitar now. And then all your half step down, open A, open G. It is quite hard to play and hold a camera at the same time, but there's no one else here to do it for me. <laughs> um, yeah, pretty much it, really. Thanks for watching. See you in a bit.